Different countries have different systems for people to access healthcare services. In some countries, you can phone and ask a doctor to treat you at your home for any illness, or you can go to a hospital to see a doctor. It is different here in Alberta. This video will tell you what you can do when you're sick. When you're sick or injured, you should seek treatment as soon as possible. Here are your choices. 1. Call HealthLink Alberta 2. Visit your family doctor or go to a walk-in clinic 3. Go to urgent care center 4. If you think it is life-threatening or could be life-threatening, go to an emergency department in a hospital. When you are sick or injured, you can call HealthLink Alberta. HealthLink Alberta is a 24-hour nurse advice and health information telephone service. You can call HealthLink Alberta to get information about health concerns that you have. It is operated by nurses and information specialists. You can press 1 on your phone to speak to an information specialist to find the health services within your area, or press 2 to speak to a nurse for any health advice. It is a free service available 24 hours per day, 7 days per week. HealthLink Alberta is available to the whole province of Alberta. You can call HealthLink Alberta toll-free at 1-866-408-LINK, that's 5465, in Edmonton at 780-408-LINK, that's 5465, or in Calgary, 403-943-LINK, that's 5465, to speak to a HealthLink Alberta nurse through a phone interpreter. You don't have to worry about communicating in another language. HealthLink Alberta and phone interpreters break through communication barriers to help people get the information they need. When you phone HealthLink Alberta, you will first hear a recorded message in English explaining the service. Do not hang up the phone. Instead, press 2 on your phone to speak to a nurse. After you press 2, do not hang up the phone. Wait on the line someone will speak to you soon. When a nurse comes on the line, all you need to do is to state the name of the language you speak in English. For example, I speak Cantonese. Do not hang up the phone, as a phone interpreter will then be arranged for you so you can ask questions in your first language. The interpreter will help the nurse understand your situation, and they will then interpret advice from the nurse about what you should do including things that can be done safely at home and whether you need to be seen by a doctor. Those who do not have a family doctor and do not have a life-threatening medical concern but need attention within 24 hours can be referred by HealthLink Alberta to a doctor who will see them the next morning. When you are sick or injured, you can also visit your family doctor or go to a walk-in clinic. If you have a family doctor, you should make an appointment to see your doctor when you're sick. In Canada, it is important for you and your family to find a family doctor. A family doctor offers services such as annual checkups, monitoring of the growth and development of your children, giving prescriptions, and ordering tests such as mammograms, pap tests, bone density tests, x-rays, blood tests, etc. Depending on your health conditions, your family doctor might give you a referral to a specialist. After your visit to a specialist, it is important to be followed up by your family doctor so that your medical history will be kept in one place. Therefore, it is a good idea to have a family doctor for yourself and your family. If you do not have a family doctor or your family doctor is not available, you can go to a walk-in clinic. Walk-in means you do not need to make an appointment. When you arrive, 
show your Alberta health care card. If this is the first time to visit a walk-in clinic, you will be asked to fill out a medical history form. You then wait to be seen by a health care provider. The doctor will see you on a first-come, first-served basis. Walk-in clinics are not meant to replace your family doctor. It is important for you to be followed up by your family doctor after you visit the walk-in clinic. To find a walk-in clinic, look up clinics in the Yellow Pages telephone directory. When you are sick or injured, you can also go to an urgent care center. An urgent care center is a medical center for people who have unexpected but not life-threatening health concerns that need to be treated on the same day they came. These include broken bones, muscle sprains, asthma, pain, and infections. Both adults and children can be treated at any urgent care center. You do not need an appointment. Most urgent care centers are open seven days a week. For example, in Calgary, the Sheldon M. Schumer Health Center is open 24 hours a day. For a list of urgent care centers and locations, you can call HealthLink Alberta or visit www.albertahealthservices.ca to find one. People with life-threatening or possible life-threatening conditions should not go to an urgent care center. They should go to the emergency department at a hospital right away or call 911 for ambulance services. Emergency departments offer 24-hour medical care for everyone. They also treat life-threatening health problems. The Alberta Children's Hospital in Calgary cares just for children from birth to age 18. If you do not speak English and need to use 911 to call the ambulance services, follow these steps to get help in another language. Dial 911. Wait for an officer to speak to you in English. Tell the officer the name of the language you speak in English. For example, I speak French. Do not hang up. Wait for an interpreter to help you. With the help of an interpreter, tell the officer. You need the ambulance services, what the life-threatening problem is, whether the person is conscious or not, whether the person is breathing or not, the age and gender of the person who needs help. If possible, stay on the telephone until ambulance arrives. Alberta Healthcare does not cover ambulance charges. You do not have to pay for an ambulance right away. You will be sent a bill later on. If you cannot pay the bill, there will be a phone number on the bill that you can call to arrange payment. What is the process of being seen in an emergency department? It is important for you and your family to carry the Alberta Health Care card to receive health care services. People who come to emergency departments will be assessed by a triage nurse to determine their medical urgency. Sickest patients are seen first. Patients who are less sick will be asked to wait in the waiting area. Once you are in the treatment area, a nurse will ask you questions about your health condition. Some tests might be done. When the doctor comes to see you, you will be asked similar questions. The doctor asks these questions just to make sure you are given the proper diagnosis and treatment. If you have trouble speaking or understanding English, tell a staff member what language you speak. And if the service exists in your area, an interpreter will then be arranged for you in person or over the phone. By using a trained interpreter, you can avoid misunderstanding. As well, your privacy is very important. Interpreters will keep all information confidential, just like any healthcare professional. Not all rural areas have emergency departments. Even if they do, not all rural emergency departments are open 24 hours a day. It is a good idea to find out where the nearest emergency departments are located. Most of the care given in the hospital is covered by Alberta Health Care Insurance. For a complete list of hospitals in Alberta, please call HealthLink Alberta toll-free at 1-866-408-LINK, that's 5465. In Edmonton at area code 780-408-LINK or 5465. Or in Calgary at 403-943-LINK, that's 5465 or visit www.albertahealthservices.ca. 
So when you are sick or injured, you should seek treatment as soon as possible. Your choices are call HealthLink Alberta, go see your family doctor or go to a walk-in clinic. Go to an urgent care center. If you think it is a life-threatening or could be life-threatening, go to an emergency department in a hospital. If you have questions,